I'm picking on a very specific thing that Matt Walsh has said here. A record of success in dating does not mean that you've dated a lot of people. That is, in fact, a record of failure. Okay, if you've dated a lot of people, you're, you're bad at dating. You're bad at this. No one should listen to you. If you are, say, in your late 20s or early 30s, and you've been on hundreds of dates with many dozens of different people, that doesn't mean that you're good at dating. It means that you are apparently not good at it. In a similar way, if a college senior is now heading into his seventh year of college, it doesn't mean that he's really good at college. We shouldn't say, this guy's great at college. He's been doing it forever. Uh, it means precisely the opposite. So dating, like college, should move from one step to the next until you graduate. People qualified to give dating advice, the only people qualified to give it are those who have graduated. And graduation, in this case, of course, is marriage. The whole point of dating is to graduate to marriage. People who have a lot of experience in dating might not be in it for a long-term relationship. They might be in it for something else. They might be in it for sex. But regardless of why they're into it, if they have a lot of experience and know the things not to do, they may have some information that could benefit anyone who is in the dating pool. If the first, second, or third time you've ever really dated, you ended up falling in love and you got married, what advice are you going to give to someone who is in the dating pool? Follow the steps you can remember following? What if that wasn't even it? If you don't have enough experience, you might not even know what it was that, that you did or didn't do that made the person like you as much as they did. I mean, if there's, if there's chemistry, I mean, you can't, you can't put any formula to that. But yeah, if you have very little experience, why would your input matter that much to people? People learn from their mistakes the most. So why wouldn't that apply here? If you have very little experience, what mistakes would you even recognize that you've made? Sorry, this was just something that bothered me. It's not the greatest video or anything, so have a joy, joy day.